Good day everyone. Today, I am here to talk to you about diabetes mellitus. First, let's define what it is. Diabetes mellitus is a metabolic disorder which is characterized by high blood glucose levels caused by the body's inability to produce or respond properly to insulin. It is a serious disease that can cause many health complications such as heart disease, kidney failure, and even blindness. Now that we know what diabetes mellitus is, let's talk about the different types of diabetes. There are three main types, type 1 diabetes or juvenile diabetes, type 2 diabetes or non-insulin dependent diabetes, and gestational diabetes or pregnancy-induced diabetes, as well as prediabetes. Next, let's discuss the signs of high blood glucose levels, which are increased fatigue, urination, dry mouth, and blurred vision. High blood glucose levels can lead to many complications such as heart disease, kidney disease, and stroke. So how do we manage diabetes mellitus? It can be managed with lifestyle changes, oral medications, insulin as well as consulting a healthcare provider. Monitoring and testing should be done regularly in order to watch for A1C levels, eye exams, lipid level tests, foot testing, and more. Physical activity and a healthy diet are important for the management of diabetes mellitus. Eating nutritious foods, controlling portion size, avoiding added sugars, and eating high-calorie meals can all help in the management protocol. It is important to note the signs of low blood glucose levels such as excessive shakiness, confusion, sweating, hunger, and a fast heartbeat. In order to prevent low blood glucose, it is recommended to do sick day management plans that involve checking blood glucose levels more frequently and looking out for signs of diabetic ketoacidosis. Finally, I'd like to remind everyone that there are many diabetes support services out there such as diabetes support groups, online resources, and healthcare providers. Check the link for downloading this presentation PPT. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about diabetes mellitus.